What's up world, it's Dallas with Gadget Hacks, and today I'm going to show you how to automatically greenify apps on a non-rooted device. Now greenify is a very cool app that allows you to put battery hogging apps into hibernation. This effectively closes the apps in question and prevents them from starting back up in the background until you personally open them. Up until now, this hibernation feature was a fairly convoluted process on a non-rooted device. You had to manually force close each app for it to work, and that definitely wasn't what you would call ideal. But developer Oasis Fang has somehow found a way to do all this for you automatically with the app's latest update, even without super user access. So go ahead and install Greenify, which you can get from the Play Store for free, then we'll open it up and check out the setup process. First up, other than closing out any messages, just hit this Greenify button at the bottom of the screen. From here, you'll be taken to a list of the apps that are either currently running in the background, or can start up without any interaction from you. These are really the only apps that you need to concern yourself with, since these are the best candidates for hibernation. Other apps that don't start up on their own won't have as big of an impact on your battery life, so you don't really need to worry about them. But from here, just select any apps that you would like to force into hibernation. Again, hibernation will prevent them from running in the background, so you may not want to do this for apps that you'd like to receive notifications from when you're not using them. But, if you see an app that has this little cloud logo to the right of it, which, if you look very closely, says GCM, you can hibernate that safely without having to worry about missed notifications. That's because these apps use the Google Cloud Messaging Platform to deliver notifications, and that service is tied to the core of Android, so it'll always be running. With that in mind, finish selecting your apps, then press the check icon at the top of the screen. Then, to begin setting up the auto hibernation feature, tap this little Z button at the bottom of the next screen. From here, you'll be taken to the App Info page for the first app you were trying to hibernate. This little pop-up explains that you can go about this next step in one of two ways. Either the old way of manually pressing force stop on each of the next screens that show up, or by enabling Greenify's accessibility plugin to have the app do all this for you automatically. The second option is the one we want here, so I'll tap Enable Automation to set that up. From here, find the Greenify entry, then tap it. Next, just toggle the switch at the top of the screen to ON, then press OK on this next pop-up. Now head back into Greenify to enable one more option. From here, just hit the three-dot menu button and select Experimental Features. On this screen, tap Automated Hibernation, then press Activate on the message that pops up next. It'll send you back to the settings screen, so from here just make sure the box next to Automated Hibernation is ticked. At this point, you're all set up. Greenify will now automatically hibernate your apps periodically. It does this only while the screen is off, so it won't interfere with your day-to-day -day usage. The screen comes on briefly when it's time to hibernate apps, then Greenify does its thing, and the screen goes back off. So you should notice a nice bump in battery life, even without having to bother with Greenify any further. But for the full breakdown, be sure to check out my article at the link in the description below. And as always, we'd appreciate it if you would like and comment on this video and subscribe to our channel. So we'll see you again next time, folks. But until then, happy gadget hacking.